also breaking in Madison County tonight. A two year old boy is dead after being attacked by a neighbor's dogs in New Hope. This marks a tragedy now striking yet another Valley family in the same way twice in one week. We're told this happened just after five tonight. The attack happened at a neighbor's home along TR Christian Road in New Hope. Now on your screen are the two dogs believed to be behind the attack. This is video if we could pull that up video of them being seized by animal control officers tonight. Don Webster with Hemsey says the attack happened just before 530 this evening. Ricky Clark, the owner of the dogs, believes the boy got into his backyard by opening the gate himself. The gate was latched but not locked. He says his dogs have never harmed anyone before. Take a look. Clark actually allowed our reporter into his backyard to demonstrate just how easy it was for things to go horribly wrong tonight. And this is something you'll only see on 48 News. And see, I keep it locked all the time. All you do, you just tell you to shut it like that. And say no, they ain't never got out, ain't never been out of nothing. But that little boy's up big enough, tall enough, he just flipped it open, got it open, managed to get it open somehow. That's what I think. Now, I wasn't here, but the gate was open, the dog was out. Okay, so at this point, we don't know the name of the boy who died or whether the dogs will be put down as a result of these attacks. We do know the breed of the dogs were a Husky and a German Shepherd Golden Retriever mix. As always, as soon as we get information about this sad situation, of course, we'll provide that latest detail online and on air.